Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of From Paycheck to Prosperity. It's Adela Passos here, and today we're diving into a topic that's buzzing around in the realm of workplace culture. Is the traditional 9 to 5 model outdated for the modern working environment? So let's buckle up and explore the changing tides in the world of working hours. The traditional 9 to 5 model was once considered the norm, but now is encountering new challenges in the modern work environment. One of the driving forces behind questioning the 9 to 5 is the pursuit of flexibility and productivity. It's like recognizing that peak productivity doesn't always align with rigid time frames. Flexible working hours can actually empower employees to manage their schedules in ways that optimize their productivity and their well-being. The rise of remote work and advancements in technology have reshaped the way that we approach working hours. It's like breaking down the walls of the traditional office. With the ability to connect and collaborate from anywhere, the constraints of a fixed working schedule are now reimagined. The quest for work-life integration has fueled the conversation. It's like acknowledging that life doesn't nearly fit into just these little compartments of work and little compartments of personal. Employees are seeking a balance where working hours can be flexible and accommodate personal responsibilities and their pursuits. A lot of us have seen a shift towards results-oriented approach, and this is gaining traction. It's like focusing on the outcomes rather than spending hours at your desk. And I like the idea that companies are actually valuing performance and contributions over presence during specific work hours. So consideration for employee well-being is also been a driving factor in reevaluating the work hours. It's like understanding that burnout and stress can arise from these rigid work schedules. Flexible hours allow employees to better manage their energy levels and maintain a healthier work-life balance. However, there are some challenges and some considerations. Adapting to flexible working hours requires effective communication, team collaboration, and of course, establishing clear guidelines to ensure accountability and cohesion. So in conclusion, my friends, the question of whether the traditional nine to five model is outdated is really a reflection of the evolving nature of working environments. It's about striking a balance between structure and flexibility to create an environment where employees can thrive. And that's it for today's episode of From Paycheck to Prosperity. Thanks for joining me in on this exploration of the traditional workday. If you're interested in my list of top recommended business resources, head on over to adelapasos.com and I'll catch you in the next one where we'll continue to unravel the intricacies of business and prosperity. Take care.